Now, are you finished? I'm just warming up. Twisting of the nose. Pulling out of the hair. Penetration of the little wooden stick into the earrings. Extraction of the brain through the fingernails. Laceration of the spinal column. If only that would remove the spine from her personality. Not to mention the opening of the bladder. And for a grand finale, a new rendition of the great separation of St. John the Baptist's head from his body. All of which is drawn from the holy scriptures from the Old as well as the New Testament, collated, corrected, and perfected by the present and accounted for master of finances. How does that grab you, Ingleberry? Mercy, Paubu. For it, my friends, long live Poland! Oh, oh! Wait a bit, Mr. Polak. Wait until I'm done with Madame, my lesser half. There, coward, beggar, desperado, miscreant, Muslim. There? The Polak, drunkard, bastard, buzzard, tartar, fathead, cockroach, stool pigeon, greaseball, communist. There, eunuch, pig, felon, Ham, rascal, sloven, bedspread! Gods, what reinforcements? We have feet too, you Polish Poles! Oh, in the name of my green snot, will it never end at the end of the end? Another one? Ah! If only my financial horse was here! Hit him again! Hit him again! Harder! Harder! Long live Pope! Our great financiers! Ah! There they are! Hurrah! Here come the Ubu's fathers! Carry on! Get in here! We need you! Financial gentlemen! Head for the hills, you Pauls! And so we meet again, Mr. of the Finances. Forward! Fight fiercely! Try to reach the entrance. Once we're out, all we have to do is run like hell! Oh, that's the hardest I can hit. Ouch, D plays pretty rough. God, I am wounded. It's just a scratch, sire. I'm just dizzy, that's all. Let's get them. They're at the mouth, the slobs. We're making it, by consequence of which I can see the sky. Make haste, sire Ubu. Ah, oh, I'm making in my pants. Forward, horny cornhole! Kill him! Bleed him! Skin him! Slaughter him! Belly of Ubu! Ah, it's getting easier! There's only two still guarding the entrance! Ah, uh, and a one! And a two! Oof! I'm outside! Let's get out of here! Follow me! You others! And move it! Ah, I think they've given up trying to catch us. Yeah, Buggerless has gone to get his crown. I don't envy him, that crown. You ain't whistling Dixie, Pa Ubu. <laughs> ah, what a beautiful breeze. It is a fact that we are escaping with rapidity, verging on the prodigious. We must be making a million knots an hour, and these knots are so well tied that once done, they cannot be undone. Of course, we have a tailwind. What a sad imbecile. Oh, 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 oh God! Oh. Everyone to leeward, set the foresail! Ah! No, not that! Don't all put yourselves on one side, that's imprudent! But if the wind changes direction? Everyone sinks to the bottom and we're all fish bait! Fall off! No, no, don't fall off! We'll never get there, and I want to get there, I'm in a hurry! Don't fall off, do you hear? It's your fault, you brutish captain, if we don't make it! We've got to get there! Oh well, I'll take command! 
Prepare to turn about. God. Drop the anchor. Tack with the wind in front. Tack with the wind in back. Hoist the sails. Reef the sails. Helm up. Helm down. Helm sideways. See? It's going great. Bring the ship athwart the waves and we'll be perfect. Haul down the main jib. Reef the topsails. That's not bad. It's even good. Do you hear, Mr. Crew? All down for eight ships, reefers, and tonsils. <laughs> Whoa! What a deluge! That's the effect the maneuvers we commanded. Navigation is a delicious thing. <laughs> Renounce Satan and haul his palm. Sire waiter, pop us a drink. <laughs> <laughs> ah, how delightful to see sweet France again. Our old friends and our castle of Montagon. We will be there soon. We're just passing the castle of Elsinore. I feel all perked up at the thought of seeing my dear Spain again. <laughs> yes, and we'll astound our comrades with tales of our marvelous adventures. Oh. That's for sure. And I shall get myself named Master of Finances in Paris. Just the ticket. Oh, what a bumpy ride. It's nothing. We're just rounding the Elsinore Peninsula. And now our noble vessel flies swiftly over the somber waves of the North Sea. Fierce and inhospitable sea, which washes the country called Germany. So named because the inhabitants thereof are always germinating. <laughs> That's what I call erudition. They say it's a lovely land. Gentlemen, it may be beautiful, but it can't equal Poland. Without Poland, there'd be no spits in Polish. <laughs> what do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor?